Hello everyone, and here I am with another brick and Lego Brick Ads review, and this is on the Nightmare Before Christmas 2-pack that was recently released. Okay, so on the front of the box here, you see Lego logo, Brick Ads logo, and the two that come within, Jack Skellington and Sally. And then the Nightmare Before Christmas 25-year anniversary logo, and age recommendations 10 and up, set number 41630, and has 193 pieces. The iconic scene of it could have done a in film image or something, but whatever. And then on the back are the two Rickheads looking eye to eye at each other, and how you put on on the bases and yeah. And onto the booklets. Well, it's two instruction booklets like these Brickhead two packs usually do. You see the same pictures on the front and everything. First one of which is add for the online survey, and then add for Lego Life with Jack Skellington there, and then Sally's, of which same add on the back, and all the pieces included, and last building set. So first off of which is the star of it, Jack Skellington, of which looking pretty good. Like as you see, like the like silver or white linings of which, of which, just about like the in film outfit he has, and also with the tie of which, I think it should have been like brick built multiple pieces then, but I, which you know you could just make that multiple pieces if you wanted to, and also the like one by two or one by one bricks. That form the legs, of which have print on one side. So, of which quite interesting and unique, which could work out well in some mocks and stuff. And then the back of which, as you see, has a lot of the tooth pieces acting as his coattail parts and all. And as the shaping of which, with some rounded parts to it, I think they should have done a rounded part on the back of the head. Since of course it's more rounded and all. And interesting with the face is, as he has the iconic mouth, but the eyes of which is actually a 1x4 tile with the eyes printed on rather than being the traditional brick head's head and its eyes. Probably to make it a bit more skeletal and all. And yeah. And now into Sally. Of which the main color of which is mostly this odd uh, 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 bluish green color or, which of course Sally usually is but it's the first time seeing that in a non friends set but yeah and also this earthy green uh, slope piece is used for the skirt on both sides quite well and of course little bit of like non-symmetry there like some yellow on this arm and azure on this arm uh, not sure if that's present or in the in film appearance but whatever but also a nice uh, one by four brick with uh, like stitchings of her on it and of course the trademark uh, long dark red hair which built pretty well. Some like good sloping, you know, and all around. And of course, the face of which does have built quite well. Like with that stitching above, and yeah. And what else is there to say about it? Not much, but might as well go on to the final work. So, final verdict on this brick hat set. This, I think, is a pretty good brick hat set. Like, get one of the most iconic films in this form. And this of which kind of gives hope for some uh, minifigure sets for the Nightmare Before Christmas in the future. If you're watching this LEGO, I would really appreciate that. And if, so if you're a large fan of the Nightmare Before Christmas, then go ahead and pick this up. And if you're a large Disney collector person, 
then definitely go ahead and pick this up for your collections. And that is it. Also, if you're a large BrickHeads completer collection, definitely go ahead and get this. And that is it for this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe, and thanks for watching.